Hi guys, it's Tommy here at Raw Blend and today I'm gonna to make for you a delicious new Christmas recipe. This is my vegan Christmas pudding bliss balls recipe. Now this recipe has two steps. Uh, firstly, I'm gonna make my bliss balls, which will be my pudding. And then secondly, I'm gonna make like a cashew frosting. So firstly, I've got half a cup of walnuts, half a cup of pecans, absolutely beautiful. So when you're making bliss balls in your Vitamix, you wanna be really accurate with your measurements. So right on one cup. Next, I'm gonna put in one cup of dried fruit. I'm using half a cup of fresh medjool dates uh, without the pit. And I'm also gonna put in half a cup of raisins. Now I've got one tablespoon of orange zest, one teaspoon of cinnamon for some beautiful spice, and also one teaspoon of nutmeg. So some beautiful Christmas uh, flavors in there. So I'm gonna lock my lid into place. I'm gonna start off on speed five to six, and I'm just gonna pulse it just to get all the um, food incorporated together. And then I'm gonna use my tamper uh, for another 30, 40 seconds, see how we go. That's how quick and easy it is. I've got that beautiful Christmas pudding, bliss ball consistency in the base of my container. I'm gonna add in my crystallized ginger and my dried cranberries. And I'm just gonna blend that on slow speed, you know, four to five, just to give it a bit of a chunky texture. Look at that. Use one of these spatulas. Uh, this is the best tool. Uh, we sell these on our website, absolutely delicious. And I'm gonna put that in the freezer just for about 10 minutes um, so it's easier to roll into bliss balls. So firstly for my frosting, I've got one cup of cashews, just raw cashews. Next I have two tablespoons of maple syrup. I'm gonna add in a third of a cup of coconut cream, a pinch of lemon zest, and a quarter of a teaspoon of this beautiful vanilla extract. Give my frosting a nice vanilla flavor. So I'm just gonna start that on a low speed, about speed five or six. I might increase the speed a bit just to combine everything more. And I'm also gonna need to add more coconut cream as I go, just to give it that nice frosting whipped consistency. exactly what I want, that beautiful consistency. Take a look at that. So let's be honest, this is how everyone tries it at home. <laughs> so good. Okay, so let's roll our Christmas pudding bliss balls. And they're a beautiful consistency. I think that's about the perfect size. You can see that nice uh, dried cranberry in the side there. That's the nice chunky bits I've added through. I'm just gonna flatten the tops of the bliss balls out slightly. I'm just gonna drizzle over my cashew cream frosting and I wanna let that run down the sides. Now I'm just gonna garnish these with some dried cranberries and some pepitas or pumpkin seeds which look like little leaves. Pretty cute. Happy blending.